Drilling is one of the more basic operations in the machinist trade and is often performed in a sensitive drill press or a radial arm drill press. In this videotape, you will be shown the basic parts of these drill presses and their functions. After viewing this videotape, you should be able to write down the safety precautions which must be practiced when drilling with a drill press, name the basic parts of a sensitive drill press and describe their functions, and name the basic parts of a radial arm drill press and describe their functions. When you are operating a drill press, you should follow these safety practices. Always wear safety glasses. Wear clothing that will not get caught in the machine and roll your sleeves above the elbow. Take off your rings and other jewelry. Never leave tools lying on the drill press during operations. If you are moving heavy vices or workpieces onto the table or base of a drill press, have someone help you. Always clamp the work to be drilled. For smaller pieces, secure them in a vise and clamp the vise to the table. Never drill a piece that is handheld. Always remember to remove the chuck key from the drill press before you start the machine. When you're removing taper shank drills from a drill press spindle with a drill drift, put a block of wood below the drill point to protect the cutting edges. Always use a brush to clean up chips. Never use rags around a drill press that is in operation. Drill presses throw out oil and chips that collect on the floor around the press. Sweep up the chips and wipe up the oil so that you will have a safe working area. The sensitive drill press gets its name from the way the tool is fed into the work. The operator controls the cutting action by feel. Sensitive drill presses may be floor mounted or bench mounted and are generally used for light duty applications only. They generally accommodate drills ranging from very small to one half inch in diameter. The capacity of the machine is measured from the center line of the drill to the column. A 10 inch drill press, for example, is 10 inches from the drill center to the column and can drill to the center of a circular workpiece 20 inches in diameter. Sensitive drill presses have four basic parts. The head, the column, the table, and the base. The head of the machine contains the mechanisms for driving and feeding the tool. The spindle rotates inside of a quill and moves up and down by means of a feed lever on the side of the head. The quill can be locked in place with the quill lock. Sensitive drill press spindles are usually hollow with a Morse taper machined inside. This taper accepts the Morse taper of a drill chuck or the taper shank of larger drills. Be cautious about using large taper shank drills in a sensitive drill press since they are not generally powerful enough for continual drilling of large holes. Abusing the machine in this way will wear it out prematurely. The spindle is driven by motors and belts. Your machine will generally have either a V-belt with cone pulleys or a variable speed drive. To change speeds on the cone pulley drive, you can change the belt to different sets of pulleys. The larger the pulley on the motor, the faster the spindle will turn. The variable speed drive changes speeds by moving the halves of a split pulley. The closer the halves are together, the faster the spindle will turn. To change speeds with a variable speed drive, the motor must be running. Sensitive drill presses are equipped with a switch for turning the motor on and off. Some machines will also have a high and low range switch. Most machines will have a depth stop, which allows you to drill to a precise depth and to drill any number of holes to the same depth. Some sensitive drill presses will be equipped with a power feed. On floor mounted drill presses, the table can be moved up or down with a table lift crank. On bench and floor models, the table is locked in place with a table lock. 
This machine, the radial arm drill press, is probably the most versatile drilling machine you will find in the shop. The radial arm drill press gets its name from its distinctive feature. This arm is the radius of the arc through which the machine operates. By swinging the arm and moving the head, you can move the drill rather than the workpiece. This enables you to drill holes in large, heavy workpieces without moving the work. The size of a radial arm drill press is measured by the diameter of the column and the distance from the center of the spindle to the column when the head is at full extension on the radial arm. This machine, for example, has a nine inch column and measures three feet from column to head at full extension. This machine can therefore drill to the center of a circular workpiece six feet in diameter. The radial arm drill press has the same basic parts as the sensitive drill press. A column fastened to the base which supports a radial arm. The radial arm in turn supports the head. The radial arm moves up and down the column by power. It locks in position for drilling operations. The drill head moves back and forth on the arm by hand crank. It is equipped with a lever that lowers and raises the spindle either by hand or with power. The head is also equipped with an RPM selector and a lever to select clockwise or counterclockwise rotation. The head can be locked in place on the radial arm with a locking lever. The spindle on this machine is hollow with a taper for accepting drill chucks or taper shank drills. To remove chucks or drills from the taper, you use a drill drift. The radial arm drill press will usually have a large heavy table for clamping the work or for clamping vices which hold the work. The base is equipped with T-slots for clamping work tables or for clamping large work pieces directly to the base. The radial arm drill press may also have a coolant system to provide continuous lubrication and cooling to the tool during operations. To review what you have seen in this videotape, you should know the safety precautions required in operating drill presses. You should now know the basic parts of the sensitive and radial arm drill presses and their functions. These drill presses are basic machine tools. It is important for you to become familiar with their use to increase your productivity and machining accuracy in the manufacture of parts that are vital to industry.